hello friends today in this tutorial i'll be showing you that how to make a camera app in which you can click photographs and also you can record videos as well inside your flask application so basically this will be a python application and let me just show you a short little demo of this uh, video capture application so basically if i let me run this application uh, in the command line so as i run this application you will see that uh, it will run on localhost 5000 and you will see this is my face here running here this is coming through my webcam which is there on the laptop and you will see on my face here so basically there are some instructions given here there is stop start button so it basically toggles between the start or stop live streaming and capture is the button which will take the photograph of the person and save it in the shorts directory so inside my directory you will see it has automatically created this directory which is shorts directory so basically if you take a picture it will store that picture inside that directory the third is that uh, you can also apply some uh, filters as well which is there inside uh, snapchat so this is a gray filter here you will see my webcam is turned into black and white gray like structure if you toggle this you will see this is colored colored here if you toggle it you will see that so various snapshot filters you can apply here this is a negative filter you can see that this is changed into negative you can see black and white this is a special filter that you see in various uh, camera apps so this is the negative filter you can see that and if you only want the face you can also just crop the face only you will see this I am only detecting my face so basically this is face detection so if you don't want the background you only want the face so you can also do this also using this is using some artificial intelligence so basically it is only cropping the face and this is the for the video recording guys if you want to record your video so it can also record the video so first of all we will see how to capture uh, photographs if i click the capture button you will see it has taken the photograph of you and let me check the directory you can see it has captured the photograph and it has saved it inside this directory as a png file i can again click the capture button you will see that you can see that i have clicked more photos here like this you can see that so this is the uh, photograph app guys now we can also click the stop button so basically this will turn off the webcam of uh, the laptop if i once again hit it it will once once again turn on the webcam and there is a, a stop uh, video recording button guys if i click the, this button the video recording will start here you will see that it is saying to me that it is recording here so now your video recording has been started so basically uh, you can just uh, record your video so basically guys you can see that uh, this uh, uses open cv inside the background if i click again this button my video has been successfully saved inside the root directory so basically this is the video which is saved here guys you can see that if i want to open this this is the mp4 video which is saved here the audio is also there i think uh, audio is not there only the video is saved so there is a option also given if you want to also record the audio you just need to turn off that option so this is your video guys which is saved here automatically as a mp4 file I think it is the AVI file, so AVI file is there. So videos are saved as AVI file. So this is a all-in-all -all media recorder kind of application, guys. Camera application in Flask. All the source code of this application will be there inside video description. I have written a complete blog post on my tutorial website codingsiksha.com. So these two dependencies are required: Flask and OpenCV Python. So this is the source code which is there guys you can see that you can copy paste this source code these two files are there so just go to the video description link and copy paste all the source code let me just summarize you what is happening here so basically as you uh, download the source code you just need to run this uh, python file here so inside this file what is happening so before running this you need to download two dependencies that I tell you first is flask pip install flask 
and the second one is OpenCV. So pip install OpenCV dash Python. So these two dependencies you need to install, and also the third one which is NumPy. So just install these three dependencies guys and now inside this file what is happening here it is first of all making this dynamic directory which is shorts directory in which all the photographs will be saved here and these are some of the variables which are declared here you will see gray negative face filter so these are some of the filters out there and uh, this is the index.html file here you can see that these are input fields out there buttons whenever you click these buttons the photographs is clicked and the video recording is started and these are all the video filters that you see and this is for the video feed and one more thing guys you can also if you want to see only the video feed uh, you can also go to this URL which is slash video underscore feed so this will only show you the video feed I think it is video feed I think the application is stopped let me once again start this video underscore feed so if you go to it this needs to be video underscore feed so only the video will be shown to you this is the video feed that is coming through the web camera you will see that this is the video here of the web camera so this is overall application guys uh, and you can see that uh, this is the index.html file these are all the buttons out there and this is the backend server which is using uh, OpenCV library to making uh, to make this application so these are the templates folder inside our templates folder this index.html file is there so we are just loading it from the templates folder and then we are having this video capture you can also use some other captures as well so we are passing the zero, zero number here this signifies that this will use the web camera from the laptop and then this is a record function which is actually writing the all the frames of the webcam to for the slight delay which is 0 0.05 second and detect face is a function which will actually detect the face and this is from complicated code that you can see here if you understand you can fully understand on your own so this is all the code guys so simply go to the video description link and copy paste all the source code please hit the like button subscribe the channel as well and i will be seeing you in the next video until then thank you very much